Hey guys, Bill here from Thimble Wasp. Someone recently asked about gain staging. They own the Anvil, the Space Camp, and the Time Lapse. And they also have a Klon. And they had read that the Anvil was good for uh, stacking with the Klon. So I thought I'd show a demo of how we have used that. Now, today I am playing through a Marshall JTM 60 half. And I've got an Ibanez that has humbuckers. So I'm going to start by showing you the clean sound. You can hear how that tone is just very flat and dry. So now I'm going to click on the Klon. Now there are a lot of great Klons out there. I have a homemade version. If you're not familiar with the Klon sound, it's just a very fat, thick, uh, warm overdrive. Uh, so you're really going to hear the sound fatten up here. And I've got the gain set just to the edge of breakup, meaning that uh, if I pick lightly, I can get a clean sound. If I pick a little more aggressively, you can hear some of that dirt coming through. And overall, it's starting to shape the tone. It gives it a lot of lift. <laughs> Click on the time lapse tape delay mode just to give it a little depth. Here we go into the next stage of overdrive. I'm going to click on the anvil and you're going to hear it add a significant amount of gain and bring up the highs. So those uh, higher notes really cut through. <laughs> advantage to stacking is that you can add gain with one click. You're not turning a pedal off and turning another one back on. Plus, it adds saturation to the sound and gives you a lot more sustain. Let's go ahead and stack another pedal on here. This is going to be the Space Camp Fuzz. Now I've got the vibrato turned on all the way so it's just the pure fuzz. And layering this on gives it this ultra saturated sound and it resonates forever. <laughs> Alternatively here, you could click to your amp's distortion channel uh, or use whatever distortion pedal you like to add another layer of gain. But that's gain staging in a nutshell. Uh, the way I like to run it is a clon into an anvil, which brightens it up, adds a little bit of gain. Uh, then I go into either my fuzz or full-on distortion. And those pedals all remain on. You're not turning a pedal off and turning another one on. So uh, it has both that benefit of one click to the next level and the added benefit of the tone shaping. Uh, more and more saturation and more sustain. I hope that was helpful for you guys. Feel free to let us know your thoughts, and thanks for watching. <laughs>